it's brewing, it's bubbling, and people are talking about it. This idea of dividing people into these groups, it's very ghettoizing. I don't think gender should matter. I think equality matters. We just have to call an artist an artist. <laughs>or gender inequality in the art world that I am aware of, yes. Do I focus on it? Not so much. I was actually shooting something commercial and one of my assistants came up to me and said like, good job today, I'm really proud of you. It was super insulting for me because I was like, right away I was like, would, did I, would I have not done my job well and would you have asked, said that to a man? I haven't experienced what one would call overt sexism. Sexism or discrimination is so embedded in the fabric of our society that sometimes it's not always apparent. Women in America earn two thirds of what men do. Women artists earn only one third of what men do. This is a statistic from the 80s. We're not very far from, from, from these statistics. To make it even, there would have to be more women and making more money than men to even out the time that they weren't making the even <laughs> I'm just joking. With like progress and equality in the art world, I really don't see any change. I feel like the change right now is tokenism. It's not like a real embrace of artists. Staying sequestered in a group can also, also result to just reasserting one's victimhood and being stuck in that cycle. We need to get out of this space of using people as like, oh, there's the one like black artist, there's the one female artist, or we're gonna do an all-female show. I think the art world is just a reflection of the society around us. It's a very strange existence. <laughs> Social media and the internet does provide a platform for exposure. I'm not sure if it's equating to representation. Museums are so important and it's a big way that people learn things and when it's just showcasing one narrative, it's very dangerous. It would be awesome if there were more female-owned galleries and black female-owned galleries would be even more amazing. The biggest problem is articulating the problem. It's if we could articulate the problem, be conscious of the problem, maybe we will see some change. I want to walk into a museum and have it be a space that you can experience all different types of art and that it can be this space for change and a space for thought. The future for all of us holds many opportunities. There is more gender equality. Women have to be able to be bad artists and still be included. Opportunity is the key. And we seem to be going to get it. And this is how to start. We must raise our daughters differently. We must also raise our sons differently. Hey.